I got goals to chase, I got roads to pay. Not yet where I wanna be, but I got close today. I went ghost today, I got least to say. I be focused on these dreams like I didn't sleep today. Y'all can be so amazed, y'all ain't seen nothing. It's been, it's been over a year. Like, I mean, it's been over a year since we uh, opened doors. Open doors. Well, Lock, I, yeah, we doors shut down very quickly after opening. Yeah, I mean, we we we've been formalized as like an entity for over a year, but we have truly been a brand. I would say for yeah, just under a year. Yeah, um, in store experience. Yeah, yeah in store experience. I mean, obviously, COVID forces any business and sports cards and a hobby shop is not immune to that to sort of have like a roller coaster ride because you're always following policies and protocols who can you let in who can you not let in but i think overall uh the industry the hobby and relics obviously is directly tied to that has um has experienced uh massive uptrends then you have flat lines you have dips you have uptrends again and you know, that is a combination of a lot of different variables, be it superstar athletes entering, entering new sports, uh, be it um, the this overall, so, so overall alternative investment asset class experiencing booms and experiencing yeah. drops, right? You know, it's funny, but I think like sports card, because it's an alternative asset class, is tied to things like crypto, is tied to things like NFT, because a lot of people feel and think about it in the same way. It's Similar not- Similar investors exactly. as well are going exactly, into yeah. both, those, uh, both those alt investments. But I mean, you guys like are on the front lines, you're here every day. What do you see in foot traffic? What do you see as far as people go and what are people saying to you guys? I mean, I think in this type of industry, it's the biggest thing is there's always gonna be a new like draft, play, there's gonna be a new pick, a new draft player, or there's gonna be some new player re retiring. So there's always gonna be a new opportunity to invest. And that's what people are coming in the shop for, is looking for that next opportunity. Whether it's the next um, Connor McDavid or the next Tom Brady retiring, that opportunity to find some profit or find some margin, just like us as a shop are trying to do to kind of be around or, or give opportunity for new customers. I think that's the biggest thing that we have here. That's the fun in the game as well, right? Like finding gems as well, right? Like an up and comer. Right, like there's the goats and then there's the up-and-comers that everyone Igor. wants to and... Guys, thank you so much for watching. We love doing these Shop Talk videos. We try to uh, put them out as often as we can. If you have any feedback or comments, make sure to include them in the comments below. Make sure you hit subscribe. Make sure you hit follow. Always uh, a pleasure uh, handling these videos and engaging with the audience. So thanks again, guys.